Hey folks, this is Vince with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and uh, today I'm going to show off a feat of engineering on my part. I am what you would not call resourceful when it comes to um, fixing things around the house, plumbing, stuff like that. Well, anyway, for the last two years, this has been a slow drain, pain in the butt, I plunge it every week. But I was like, okay, I gotta take this off and, and see if maybe there's something stuck in the drain. I've never seen one of these before. It's a pain in the butt. Basically, it's one of those... Well, it doesn't do it right. Oh, there it goes. But, um... Oh, that's bad. Put that back on. Alright. So, basically, the way this works is... You've got this standard pop-up drain, right? And it... Basically, if you want to keep it open, you turn it. If you want to close it, you turn it again. And it goes down like that, right? So, you're like, okay, well, how do I get this off? Okay. Well, I tried unscrewing that part. That didn't work. So uh, what I ended up doing was I jammed this. I think those are pliers or needle nose pliers. I think that's what they're called. Like I said, I'm not very handy. Well, anyway, I went ahead and did that. And then I used this set of pliers to basically turn this off. I had to use two hands, obviously, but I did that. And eventually this popped off like so. And now it looks like there's You'll need a flathead from the looks of it, a flathead screwdriver. So I got my handy dandy box of stuff here. I, half of it, I don't even know what it is, but that's okay. Um, you know, that that's what that's what this is all about. So I may need something larger than this. Let me go ahead and, uh, ooh, that's not gonna work. Let's go ahead and consult the box of mystery. And let's see what we've got. Okay, actually this might work. Okay, you know, I ordered this online for like, I don't know, 20 bucks or something like that. Yeah, I'm installing my work clothes. It's, this is what I do. I come home from work, I record some videos of games, and then, you know, I try and figure stuff out. Okay, so here we are. Let's see if this will go up again. Lefty Lucy, righty tidy, and what do you know? Oh, oh, okay. This is what's causing it. Oh, maybe I should use gloves. Ugh. Yeah. Now I know why there was a slow drain for the last couple of years. Wouldn't be surprised if I found like a dead rat in here or something. Well, anyway. Ooh, is that foul? Oh my god. Someone put me at. Alright, well, I need two hands for this trick, so I just wanted to give you a small taste into. My world of plumbing. Oh, but yeah, I need two hands. There's no way I'm going to do this. Okay, well, anyway, so that's how you take off one of these. I think they're called pop-up drains. You're going to need a way to hold the base intact, right? And then uh, so that it doesn't turn while you're using a pair of pliers to take off the top. So I know not a very helpful tutorial compared to other people that might have done something similar to this, but... Considering that I'm somewhat of a gaming nerd, I'm quite happy with myself right now. The trick is, can I get it back together? All right, well, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and sign off. Hope you're enjoying your evening. I've got work tomorrow. Oh, um, just as a quick heads up, uh, stuff coming up. Um, I've got a special um, stream coming tomorrow as the result of a sale on chrono.gg. I am under embargo. I can't tell you what it is, but... I will be streaming the game, so be on the lookout for a stream tomorrow. And then over the weekend, I'll be streaming some games on behalf of Green Man Gaming. Uh, there's a Paradox sale going on, and those are that's going to be sponsored. I was actually paid to, um, you know, record some videos for the various Paradox titles that are currently featured there. So stay tuned for a video uh, stream tomorrow and some streams over the weekend for the uh, Green Man Gaming slash Paradox sale. And, uh, yeah, hope to catch ya. Take care of yourselves and have a good night.